time. It's time. How does it feel heading into this one here? Feels good. I'm sorry. F feels good. Um, good. Ah, yeah, it feels good. Um, we work hard this camp, put in a lot of work. Um, personally, for me too, I uh, rehab myself back, um, got myself good to go, and I feel good, and I'm excited about the team and the first, you know, first game of the year. And uh, you know, people asking it, you know, hey, but I, I'm just telling them, hey, you know, kind of did it last year, but the step up to number one receiver. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't hear that. I mean, you were the number one receiver last year, but you took over the title during the season. Right. Uh, now you're going to enter the season as the number one receiver. Is there any differences for you? Uh, um, no. I don't I don't feel like there's any differences. Um, uh, like I said, I've been putting in the work at camp. Um, last year I put in the work. Um, been in a lot of different situations. Um, seen a lot of different situations. And uh, I feel pretty confident in myself to go out there and uh, make some plays and, and be in that number one role. When did you get started? did you learn that way of watching? But not every guy does that. Yeah, I learned that uh, maybe when I got to Bama. Um, high school, you know, you don't really have to study that much. Um, <laughs> not that hard, but when you get to Bama, you got to really like start looking at these guys, especially when I uh, first got there. There was a lot of older, um, really, really good players in the um, the SEC and, and on my team, but uh, yeah, um, I, I learned that maybe my freshman year in college, um, um, Colbert, Casey Colbert helped me a lot studying um, DBs. I'd go to his office and uh, yeah, we'd get right into it, and I learned, I took exactly what he taught me, and that's exactly how I still study. Oh, for sure. I don't want to go into the, this Sunday's game and, and uh, Slay gets in front of me and I'm like, oh, man, I don't even know him. I just know his name. Right. So I uh, I definitely put in the work and the time to study my opponent just to, for me to feel a little bit more calm in the game and not, like, guessing what he's doing and what I'm, what I'm going to do. Yeah, um... Uh, really, really proud of Russell Gage. Um, works, you know, he's, he's worked so hard this off season, and um, man, he's, he's gonna he's gonna explode. I feel. Uh, obviously, last year he you know came into the exploding into the league, but I think you know he's at a point where he's you know really confident in himself, knows what he's doing, and um, he's a great player. I think he's ready. Yeah, we got um we got a lot, a lot of good guys on our offense. I mean, from the off from the receivers, tight ends, running backs, but you know Sunday you'll really, really see you know what we got. Yeah, I mean preseason, uh, it, it's good to get out there and you know get some plays in, but uh. You're in camp. I mean, it's really like a preseason game every day. I mean, we did the joint practices. That's you, you can say that's two days of preseason. Those long practices days. Um, it's you know, like I said, it's good to get out there for a lot of the younger guys. But you know, I think you know we put in a lot of work on the uh, camp practices, joint practices, and uh, I think we're ready. Awesome. Thank you guys. Thank y'all.